Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Maarten and in this video I will show you how to create an equation in Excel. Now obviously you can use uh, f formulas to calculate uh, equations, um, but apart from that Excel also has a feature to insert the in equations in a more uh, graphic way. Um, don't want to see this at this point. Uh, insert equation. Yeah, this is what we're going for. This is Pythagorean theorem. And there's a few more default ones in there. Sinuses. Um, and you can also create your, your own. Uh, we're just going to delete that and start from scratch. Select this one and click delete. Yeah. And if we click on the pie symbol, then you get a dialog here with all kinds of useful uh, and somewhat hard to understand as well um, symbols. Degree. Geometry. All kinds of things. What we're going to do is we're going to create the formula that's used for to calculate the area of a circle, circle which is pi times r, uh, the radius, squared. Now we're just going to click our way through this. Here we have pi. Uh, r is pretty simple. Um, no, that's, we just add the r. And now we want to have the square appear. Now, these are visual ways that you can put the symbols in relation to one another. Now, we actually want this one. And then we have this, we have it like this. We want the, the R to be here and there we want it to. Now, we just click on here. That's gotta be the R. And this gotta be, click there. That's gotta be the two. And now, as you can see, we have two R's which would work also mathematically, but that's not the point. And then we have it. Now, this is just a visual representation. You can't uh, calculate anything with it, but of course we would say this is uh, the R, these are circle squares, and we want to calculate the area here. Then we would just do, um, it's 3.14 times that and obviously there's two ways to do uh, we could do the power function as well but we'll just use it like this oh, no 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 sorry click somewhere i shouldn't have and we can just drag this down we copied it and that's how you calculate this specific formula we'll just drag it on top and as you can see that's um, uh, not a lot nicer way to represent what you what you've called calculated than this all right i hope you found this video helpful if you have any questions you can leave them in the comments you can also subscribe to my youtube channel and if you want to receive email updates when i post a new video and get tips and tricks in your inbox on how to use excel in a smarter way click on the button in the bottom right corner of this video this will take you to my website worksmarter.tv where you can subscribe to my mailing list. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.